Hi, I'm Anna. And I'm Ben. And we are Autosave. Welcome to our channel. Daddy. <laughs> Sadness. Sadness. Uh, we're watching episode 27 of Death Note. Last episode, we got a little bit of a recap, or a lot a bit of a recap, but it was with intention and purpose, because all of that information that we were told is being sent to Roger. Roger is the only person who knows that L has died and knows that the persona or the character of Watari is dead since, you know, Light's taken over their identities for the meantime. But they seemingly had a backup plan uh, of some sort, which I don't really know how it works. They had some sort of timer in L's uh, computer room that was counting down to zero. And once it hit zero, the news, the news hit to Roger's phone. I, I wonder how it works. Like, I wonder if it had to do with Watari pressing the erase all button. I wonder if it was like, oh, this is going to consistently, like, every 24 hours, this clock's going to run, and I'll reset it. But if I'm not there to reset it, that means something happened to me. Oh, because that thing. could be his private room. That yeah. could be his bedroom. I mean, we've, at the beginning of this, like, Full show, show, we saw him in this room with a computer on the ground. So you're so right. He could reset that every night. Mm -hmm. I'm not really sure where we're going to go, man. We know that uh, certain countries have accepted Kira's ways. Mm -hmm. We don't know if time's necessarily passed. We were told that in summer of 2012, 2012, summer of 2012, um, that Kira's kills started growing in and increasing in like rate of death. And since then, the world seemingly has accepted it somewhat right mm -hmm. uh the people that supported kira originally have been emboldened in their support and have become vocal instead of anonymous through a computer screen or mm -hmm. a phone about their support for kira and i it makes me wonder and I, i'm really curious to see kind of the everyday average citizen walking down the street are they standing up a little straighter, feeling a little safer? Um, I know I get, like, nervous sometimes walking to my car in a dark parking lot. You know, would you start to feel less afraid in kind of mundane activities that sometimes you feel afraid in? I could see it that, or I could see it the exact opposite. Like, people are, like, kind of living on, like, a very thin line. Oh, what if because they don't know what his kind of criteria is yeah anymore. i mean we talked about it early on in the series but like if he starts killing criminals where like the criminal the, the criminality right the the yeah. crimes themselves are going to lessen and lessen kid so cheated on their test that like that's what i mean that's obviously like this a very severe degree but to like the same extent a school bully i don't think school i'm thinking like uh like like just like a very petty crime, you know, uh, they're like, I think it's going to completely ignore the idea that reform is an option. And that's like, that's where my head's going. Mm -hmm. Like if you were like 18, uh, stole some, like a piece of candy from a shop, you're going to jail for two years or like right. a year for, for kind of bullshit reasons or whatever. Like what, what at that point is I, how far have we escalated? I see like the intimidation and submission bringing about some form of worldwide peace yeah uh, i'm sure there wouldn't be a lot of infighting but there also wouldn't be a lot of fighting between other countries because everyone's aware of kira and the reach of kira kira can kill whoever wherever they are i the rest of the world knows what it what kira needs to kill someone right so like because of the like capturing of the death note we have like people openly knew what it took to kill mm -hmm. somebody then yeah there could be like knowledge out there there could be like groups of criminals who are like actively committing crimes and take the precautions needed that they won't be uh, killed from kira because they won't have their face shown or something that could be kind of cool like a vigilante group i could see i could see criminals starting to, to the ones that are more methodical yeah trying to work around this i can i can see that i also see i i see a lot of fear in people who 
I'm always scared to do something wrong yeah. anyway and to break a law I didn't even know was a law. Like, I'm always terrified that I'm going to do something wrong. And I feel like if I was in this universe, even though I have never even got a detention in school, I would be, I'd probably feel safe. But on the other hand, I would be like, oh my God, don't make the wrong move. What if I do something wrong? And then yeah. Kira just decides that I deserve to die. Here's a question. What is the, like, obviously we don't really know Roger and the two people in front of him at all, but what's the approach to take here? Like, Light doesn't know of their existence. Um, They know everything about who L thought Kira was, and L was right in that assumption, and I'm sure that Roger and if he brings the other two people with him, are going to go in full assuming that Light is Kira. How do you, like, what approach do you take here? That's you assuming that all of the info was sent to them. I thought so, because... Uh, I thought just the message, L is dead. Um, but didn't... Oh, uh, that, you know what? You could be right, because uh, I guess I just, like, kind of blended the end of the recap and being an L saying, like, what, this, uh, this is my record, or... This is record of my life kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I assumed that that was sent to Roger as well, but you're I right. I mean, it, it definitely could have. We on screen only saw yeah a text that text message of the death. Very true. But I mean, why wouldn't the rest of the information be sent, especially if Light Elle trusts it these people? If he had it, because we saw right after the flashback, we saw Light at the computer, so that could have been Light deleting it. But that wasn't L's private computer in his bedroom with the countdown. Very true. Who knows? I bet the story knows, and I bet it's going to tell us. <laughs> yeah, it's like uh, season three, the third book of Death Note. <laughs> Whole new story, new characters. I wonder where Chief Yagami hid the Death Note. It's a good question. I wonder if we're going to find out. Maybe. Hmm. Ready? Yeah. Sweet. Roger. December oh, 2007. Like... Roger, what did you just say? I'm afraid L is dead. <gasps> He's dead? But, but how? Well, he promised me he'd find Kira and execute him. And now you're telling me that he's been killed? <laughs> Memo. Hmm? If you can't win the game... If you can't solve the puzzle, then you're just a loser. So, which of us did L pick? Me or Nier? He hadn't chosen. Nier him. looks like L. Now that he's gone, I'm afraid he won't be able to. Which one had he chosen? Like a protege, like somebody to take over? Can't the two of you work together? All right, sounds good. <laughs> oh, it doesn't sound good to him. Nope. It'll never work, Roger. Mellow. Mellow and near. You know I don't get along with near. We've always competed against each other. Always. Use this as a healthy competition. You know what? It's fine. <laughs> near should be the one to succeed L. He's not like me. He never gets emotional. He just uses his head like it's a game or a puzzle. And as for me, I'm leaving this institution. Oh, don't waste your breath. I'm almost 15 years old. It's time I started living my own life. Am I weird for getting like visual similarities from L to Nier? 2012. Overheard him talking about a notebook. If you write a person's visual similarities, that person will die. At this point, the Japanese police should have it in their possession. Mr. President, the current owl is a fake. It was created by the Japanese police to avoid confusion and panic amongst the various international police agencies. Okay. Are you allowed? He's dead. L uh, Director Mason, this boy. <laughs> well, in a sense, you could call him the true successor to L. Huh. SPK. Handpicked FBI and CIA along with Nier. And we haven't had any new leads in a while. But posting names and faces online, I'm sorry. Hair is different. Me, yeah. People doing that who deserve to die. Hmm. Mati, you silly. You've got it all backwards. 
still, I can imagine how some people must feel. It's a good place for innocent people who lead good lives. <laughs> Look who's talking. It's more than that. Soon everyone in the world will think that way. Are you all still talking about that keto business? I'm sure it's hard not to. It's everybody's life. My YouTube. <gasps> She's probably all grown up. So grown up! Missed you guys. Wow, it's been a long time. Thank you for always taking such good care of my father. Jeez, uh, you, you're all grown up. Slap him on the head. Watson, your face is going bright red. It is? Uh, I mean, no way. <laughs> <Forget it. laughs> yes, that's right. I'd never want that for my daughter. <laughs> What? <laughs> In fact, I was thinking if you were a little younger, <laughs> he's a little old for her, right? Guess my little sister is all grown up, isn't she? You've already got a career and everything. Make it official. You should stop living together secretly and just get married already. I think that's a great. Idea. <laughs> Warming scene from the most unfortunate family in the world. The most unfortunate <laughs> family in the world. Yes, what is it, Aizawa? Hmm? <laughs> yes. Right. Okay. We have to go. Matsuda, light, come with me. It has to be something substantial, not mm -hmm. just like Kira has killed again, you know? Yeah. Wonder if it has to do with Kidnapping. SPK. Involving who? They got director Takimura of the MPA. Hmm. I'm not sure who's behind it. Are you sure about this? Unfortunately, yeah. We got the call at 612. That was about 45 minutes Facial ago. hair. The yeah. Meantime, we were able to confirm that the call originated from the director's cell phone. They want to trade the director for the notebook. Holy shit. Who's behind this? And for what reason? Dad, did you say anything to the director about the notebook? We all agreed to keep the information between the six of us, so he didn't know, did he? I never told the director, so he couldn't tell the kidnappers anything. Someone knows about the death note. And beyond that, they know that the Japanese... Near is near. It, and now they've come to claim it for themselves. Notify every bureau in the police department, but only about the... God damn it, death itself. note. Not only have you taken L away from me, but you've taken away what L looks five years later away from me. Has there been a call from the suspects? No. There's a visitor here who wants to meet with Director Takimura. My name is John McEnroe. I'm an agent with the FBI. John McEnroe. Of course, this is just an alias. It's a necessary precaution. Kira? Due to unforeseen circumstances, the director is unavailable. Pardon me, I'll get straight to the point. The Japanese police have proven themselves to be unreliable. Hmm? So in order to solve the Kira we want you to hand over the notebook to us. What? So the FBI was behind it. What are you talking about? Don't act like you don't know. This is a serious... They're coming at him from different angles. By the sound of things, it seems that the director of the Japanese police force has been kidnapped by someone. Not them. Specifically, oh, fucking Mello, right? Is Mello Do you think Mello doing it on his own? Yeah, like has his own team. Suggest to the Japanese police that we would like to assist them in rescuing the director and apprehending the culprit. We'll take the notebook once we have the opportunity. Fucking mellow. All of them are interesting characters. Doesn't it seem like he has the funds that, uh... <laughs> that Nier, Nier has. has. Jesus. I don't care what it takes. I'll be near by any means necessary. <laughs> it's like a new light verse L and like I guess lights there in the middle. <laughs> I don't know. You think that's his killing pen? Like you think he has like a pen a specifically specific for pen. Yeah. The death note? 
Probably. He's been in it for a while. I would go to like a really cute stationery store and rick pick out like a really awesome pen. <laughs> I don't like that he's eating chocolate like that. They have squares for a reason. Looks like Takamura hung himself with his tie somehow. What's wrong with you? No, this will be just fine. Huh? If Kira is responsible for this, we know he can't touch us since he doesn't know our names or faces. <gasps> Kira did That's it. That's why he mm -hmm. went after Takimura instead. That should make things rather interesting. So what are we gonna do, Mello? I'll tell you what we're gonna He's do. He's not Mello. <laughs> kidnap Soichiro Yagami's daughter. <gasps> no! No! Matsu's gonna be pissed, bro. Matsu, we but need I mean, your acrobatic skills back at it. But think about it. It's not like... Light's gonna kill his little sister. He's oh, not, yeah, not that's totally gonna narrow down gonna the suspects. Why haven't the kidnappers said anything? Are they gonna give up on the deal just because they lost their bargaining chip? I didn't think our opponents would be such pushovers. The director might not have known about the notebook, but he does know who was originally working with L. It's possible the kidnappers might be come back for us. Mm -hmm. I'll be a good girl and go to bed by myself, okay? Uh, yeah, good night. His dad is right there. One's in danger here. Our families are at risk. <gasps> no, 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 no. From the nope. Cell phone. It must be the kidnappers. This is Yagami. Look, about trading the director in exchange for the notebook, the deal's been canceled. Takimura is dead. The deal is this. The notebook for Sayu Yagami. <gasps> <gasps> Even Light. Did you see Light's face? Yeah. She's already taken. I'll contact you tomorrow. Hmm? Wait! Damn, they got me. They used the director's death as an opportunity to get to Sayu. It said Big Brother on the mm. phone. Dad, are you okay? I think it was Kira who killed the director, not the kidnappers. He probably did it because he doesn't want the notebook to fall into the wrong hands. And that means we should be the ones who investigate this. We leave the police out of it. Otherwise, Kira will find out about it and probably kill the hostage. We've just received a report that the director of the Japanese police agency has been killed. I see. By whom? By whom? It'd be interesting if it turned out to be Kira. Hmm? That's a very good point. The police won't be trading their notebook if the hostage is dead, so it protects Kira's interests. And if it is in fact Kira, we can narrow down our list Why does he have so many matches? Hmm? Have you been able to determine his whereabouts yet? Not yet. We were able to confirm that he left the institution four years ago. Mello, you never change. You always overlook the most important things because you let your emotions get the better of you. How could you leave your photo behind at the orphanage? This is Yagami. Your daughter has finally arrived. It's about time. What do you mean? You already have a pretty good idea of where we are, don't you? We'll make the exchange here. Come to L.A. by yourself. L.A.? Of course. Bring the notebook with you. Oh, Sayu. <laughs> hey, Chief. Did you hear that sound that mm -hmm. Light was making? I just checked out the show that was playing in the background. And it's being broadcast right now on a local LA station. They must have shown us that so we'd know the photo was recent. I'm taking the notebook to Los Angeles. You were right. My decision, both as deputy director of the Japanese police force and as Sayu Yagami's father. I'll take full responsibility for the consequences. That's my final word. So what you're telling me is that Kira killed Takimura, not the kidnappers? I'm simply putting it forward as a possibility. Hmm. It's not very good at darts. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying his best, Anna. Yes? This is Elle. I know. I've already heard. What investigator John McEnroe, or rather Larry Connors, had to say to Deputy Director Yagami in regards to the notebook and the Kira case. I see. Well... Pass me the phone. Huh? I'm pleased to meet you at last, L number two. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. What do you mean by that? Right. We are a new organization known as the SPK, or Special Provision for Kira. It was established to find and capture Kidda without the help of El. Our top members already know of El's death. They do? Where'd they hear that? Who the hell told them? 
As for myself, I am at the center of the SPK. You can address me as in. And? Who's this guy? L, M, Mellow, N, Near. Who's O? Holy shit. If I'm honest, I thought that uh, Nier might have been like, and I know you're Kira, L number two. It, would that be the fair assumption? That uh, whoever replaced or is faking to be L? No. No, not necessarily, because you might just assume that they wouldn't want L's death being a public information. That's true. And so that someone would take it up and that L would have asked someone there because L hadn't chosen a successor. Yeah. So it, it could be assumed that you wouldn't want the whole world to go into, into a panic that Kira had gotten to L. And that's probably why, especially, Nier has only told some high up people within the SPK mm -hmm. that L is actually dead because that would create tons of panic that the basically one force that was there to compete with Kira and to catch Kira is gone. Mm -hmm. So I don't think it's like safe to assume, but what you can assume is what Nier is assuming that the information is coming from the Japanese police. That's how yeah. Kira is getting it. So Eventually, mm -hmm. Nier or Mello might think that the person that is behind the current L within the Japanese police is Kira. Is Kira. Hmm. Okay. Mello creeps me the fuck out. I don't like him. <laughs> I'm not a fan. I love Nier. Nier's my I boy. also love Nier. Um, I can't believe they abducted Sayu. And... I'm very upset about that. Matsu's probably very upset about it, too. Um, well, he did get turned down for being old at the beginning of the episode. So maybe he thinks that if he's a part of saving her, mm. she she will want to be with him. Uh, I mean, she did say he was a catch after all, so. Yeah, just if he was a little younger. Um, can't believe that it happened. Five-year time skip, right? Yes, and he doesn't have longer hair like I thought he would. Maybe like, another time skip to come? Maybe another one? I don't know. But what's been so interesting from this episode is the the um, the um, non-word sounds that Light is making. They're having yeah. him kind of grumble or sigh or kind of even out loud. He was like, mm -hmm, you know, like mm -hmm. as he turned to the computer to look up that thing. It's is interesting to see him get actually frustrated or nervous about the new developments of the situation is there uh there's obvious like comparison with l and near is there any comparison with light and mellow like they've Look at the eyes <laughs> uh, they definitely both like are uh very emotional when it comes to winning right like mm -hmm. they they both are loved and obsessed with the idea of winning do you um, like they couldn't have worked together yeah mellow seemingly went like a a darker route uh obviously I think he's it's not... a definite definite parallel between definitely and it, it but it doesn't obviously seem like mellow is leading this charge at all on his end like no, he's, he, he's like, intelligence but the, he joined this team didn't they say like a year ago he joined them yeah. and we don't know what the team is but it seems very like seedy and possibly they might want the death note for you to be able to use it yeah uh and so he might be utilizing them in order to get it and then he will dispose of them because he is the brains behind them even getting this far yeah where do you think um do you think light light's gonna go to la as well is that yeah. like we're yeah. all going to la i i don't think light wouldn't be he probably would bring misa i don't know maybe that's the excuse right like misa has like a uh, work in another oh, country that's, yeah misa could maybe have some like modeling gig or on screen deal in la speaking of misa i'll be a good girl and go to bed by myself okay holy shit what 
It's Everybody a very was like, cute what? dress. Yes. I, I'm in love with the dress, and I was flabbergasted by that. I, I, and everyone, everyone else was else flabbergasted. Was flabbergasted. Aizawa is Aizawa jaw, like, is jaw do not floor. tell my wife about this. <laughs> um, dang. Well, I don't really... I don't know. Like, L uh, is light out of practice, you think, without L around? I think he's out of practice. I didn't see this coming. At, um, okay, because think about it. Wouldn't he have thought by killing the. Killing um, Takimura? That was his name, right? Yeah. Killing him, that the kidnappers would then try to have another hostage, another end of the. to make a deal? You know, uh, so I don't know why he, and, and he said to them, it's obvious, so he didn't know about the notebook, but he knew about the names of the team members that were investigating L, or yeah. investigating Kira with L. So, obviously he knows, by even saying that out loud, that the kidnappers would know the family names of these people on this investigation team. Correct. I don't know why... I'm surprised that it happened before he could have caught that it was going to happen. And I'm surprised that he didn't think of it beforehand. Unless he did, and that was all acting. But that seemed to be more for us to see. Yeah. And not well, for everyone else to notice in the room with him. We know how smart Light is when it comes to like him knowing his adversary. When he knows his adversary is very smart, he's going to play it differently than somebody know. who's... Yeah. So, I am like... If it was me, I would have been like, all right, uh, I'm Kira. I'm going to write in the notebook that the director is going to kill himself after trying to kill the kidnappers. Try to just get two birds with one stone, right? Yeah, but that might uh, might not have been in the realm of possibility. True, that's true. Because he was tied there, and I'm guessing they had just untied him. Mm-hmm. That had to be in the realm of possibility that Light knew that he would have his tie on still. Interesting. Yeah. But, yeah, like, has... I feel like if, if you're in any type of competition, any type of game, and you have to be on point, and your strategy has to be on point, and you're constantly playing again and again and again, and then you go on a hiatus for years... Without any competition, you're going to start to feel like there's never going to be anyone that's going to oppose you again. That's going to be as great an opposition as your last one. Yeah. Um, Nier is obviously very good at games, right? Like, at least, like... Uh, and puzzles. Yeah, puzzles and, like, uh, games, like, layering matches, like, mm -hmm. trying to build, like, a house, uh, like, towers with them. But he does not have the athleticism that l did i mean i'm sure i'm judging it based off of two thrown darts but he missed them pretty horribly yeah and l was the tennis boy he was the tennis boy and he liked to roughhouse with light yeah um interesting though i i am loving this concept of like this L and Light parallels where they're competing with each other, but then, like, Light's also getting wrapped up. Light is being wrapped up in their competition. He's not a part of their competition at the moment. He's being wrapped up in it, because their focus is not catching Kira, really. At least, well, Nier's might be, but Mellow's is just to win yeah, against just to, Nier. Yep. So, Light... And his whole future and his whole world he's building is basically being, like, as if these two children are uh, fighting over a teddy bear. Yeah. And he's the teddy bear. Yeah. It's so interesting. Who do you think L's replacement would have been? Was it, like, intentionally trying to get them to work together? Or was it, I'm like... sure L would have wanted them to. Hmm. But... It obviously seems very L-like. You know, Nier is very L-like. Yeah. So. Very. And I don't know if L would have chosen the person that was so emotionally driven, but there are going to be times, I feel, that it is going to be 
detriment to Nier that he's not so emotionally driven. I agree with you. So it t- they, it's going to be that they needed to work together mm-hmm. to defeat Kira. Which is wild because technically Kira and Nier are working together. <laughs> like trying to fight Mello right now. Trying to beat Mello. Oh, so interesting. Um, man, I, it feels like a different show. Yeah. It's a whole other book. This is a whole, a whole new story. It's like, um, a next gen kind of thing. Like I've read books where it's the same world and, um, isn't like, I, we didn't, I didn't watch like all of Soul Eat or Not, mm. but isn't like Maka and Soul still in that universe, yeah. even though it's not about them anymore? Yeah. That's kind of how it feels. Like, it's like the new generation has entered the school or the story and the characters we knew before are there in the world, but they're not the main focus. And it's certainly interesting. Light isn't gonna lay down easy though he's gonna put up a fight i don't know sure. how like what what can you do to put up a fight here you're not trying to get it's not like a game of figuring out your name they don't mm-hmm. have anything on these people if he didn't have misa i would say that he is at major major he's i think he's at some disadvantages at the moment obviously because now he has two people trying to catch him and get the death note yeah but if he didn't have misa and the eyes, he would be be at even more of a disadvantage. Definitely, I agree with you. Um, oh, but now the yes, family okay. comes into play. Yeah. Remember how many times I asked you during the season, like, what if Chief Yagami really opposes Kira well, in a in the, a way that Light has would have to debate disposing of his own father? Well, the the fact that he was so willing to kill the de- uh the deputy right kill the person in charge kill the kill the, the chief of the whole department takimura yeah takimura the fact that he was so willing to do that so early on but isn't so willing to do that for his little sister means one of two things to Mello: that one kira has no knowledge of what Light's little sister looks like, or two, Kira is very close and not willing to kill her for a reason. Mm, but if Mello's assuming that Kira can get their information with, from within the Japanese police, then... I'm sure they would have files on all of the family members, even maybe with pictures. Very true. So, so that could it, definitely pin It It does. Light. It causes suspicion mm-hmm. of whoever... Whoever is Kira has some form of affection towards Sayu that they're not killing her right away. Definitely. That they actually are trying to get her back. Weird. Ooh. He's like, in a way, playing into the hands of the people that want to figure out who Kira is. Mm-hmm. Oh, sticky situation. Very... I really hope he doesn't have to have to kill Sayu in order to keep his vision. I, I hope he finds a way to save her without compromising his, his vision fully. I want to see uh, Misa and Light's home. They definitely sleep in separate rooms. I, I highly doubt he has become an affectionate boyfriend to her. I feel like it's purely like a professional relationship. I feel to like some they sleep extent. in the same room. Yeah? Mm-hmm. She probably put up a fight. I mean, so many years. I'm sure she, like. Put up or, so much of a fight that he's doing like, it to fine. keep up appearance. Yes. Yeah. He'll probably marry her just to keep up with appearances. Yeah. My hope is that during all of this time, he has fallen in love with her. He was so unfazed by how cute she looked, though. <laughs> uh, I I thought that the imagery towards the end of the episode was really interesting. Um, when you saw light kind of like being bloodily chained and tethered to the image of l right mm. was that the last thing we saw l's he's tied to l's legacy yeah. it's like how they were handcuffed together right but um yeah the chains are still there but through l's death the blood on the chains it's still linked to his current oh. situation he still has control over light a little bit he still has an attachment it's still there. Love it. Is this going to become a paranormal show? No way. Please. I wish. <laughs> all right. All right. That's all I have you. What if, wouldn't that be 
be so cool. You'd see like Ryuk on the shoulder and then like L, L on the shoulder, <laughs> like floating over him, you know? It would be Being cool. Like if he's getting apples, why am I not getting cake? Like, or like, that's it near you're closer. <laughs> like just kind of rooting them on and having little commentary like Ryuk does. <sighs> yeah. Wouldn't that be great? I think like for fan service. Hell yeah. Yeah. I would definitely be served by that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you good? Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and we hope to see you next time.